Well, hello there, everybody. Oh, wow. Look at the light. I look like one of them old, um, I don't know. I look like something. You know what I mean. I don't know what I mean. Um, yeah, anyway, it's Friday. And Lauren's had a delivery. She's <laughs> sat on the floor looking at something that she had delivered. So, let's take a look. Here's what Lauren got delivered. A little treat to myself. <laughs> Please explain. Also close the kitchen door. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, go on, um, explain what this is all about. I followed an account on Instagram for quite a while now called um, Emily Makes Boutique. We'll leave a link to her shop in the description. Um, but she makes like candles, wax melts, reed diffusers, plug in air fresheners, anything to make your home smell nice, basically. So I made an order a little while ago, like probably back in about April, um, and ordered some wax melts. And like even you will testify, they make the house smell amazing. Ah, testify! <laughs> when she announced when her Christmas collection was going to be released, I'm like, I need to get on that because Christmas smells are the best. So I made an order, um, but when I made it, she went on holiday. So as a little like, sorry for the delay of your order, she threw in a few freebies as well, which is this and this. So they're the freebies, everything else I paid for. So tell you what I've got. We'll both have a smell and give you our opinions. First up, uh, these trio of Christmas trees, and you can get these in quite a few different smells, but I got the pack that has chestnuts and brown sugar, Christmas cookies, and gingerbread in it, because that's just like Christmas in a box, basically. So, Should have called it Chris uh, Christmas Trio. Get it? Oh, yeah. That's clever. So, these are slightly smaller than the shop pots, so I'll probably use half at a time with these. Let's smell but them. Let's you smell. might talking about right, them. This one's chestnuts and brown sugar. Not a fan of that one. No. That one's Christmas cookies. Yeah. And the last one's gingerbread, which is my favourite. Yeah, that one's quite nice. So that's what they look like. So these are one of the freebies, and these are smaller than the Christmas tree trio, so I'll probably just burn like one of these at a time. And this one is Christmas spice. I'm not going to do this down. Oh! That is Christmas, that, isn't it? Yep. What? They were really strong. Um, and then this one, the other free bit, is pumpkin and chestnut. Crack it out, girl. Crack your pumpkins out. <laughs> Next up are the shop pots, and this is Christmas spice. I actually ordered a Christmas spice one. We've already smelled it. Smells That's good. That's probably my favourite. Look, it's got little mistletoe. By the way, we're rushing because the, the battery is flashing in the this corner. This one so. is very unexpected. Like I think this smells like men's aftershave, but it's called Toasty Toes. Yeah, it's not like right. men, doesn't it? Why are you holding it out to them and asking them? I was asking you. There we go. That's got little snowflakes on it. But doesn't it smell like men's aftershave? Yes, just like men. Then we've got Christmas Eve. That smells like toilet cleaner. No, it doesn't. Kind of does. That kind of looks like toasty toast though as well. I think Christmas Eve's my least favourite out of the pack. Then it's the season. I like that one. Yeah, it's got loose sort of ball things on top so yeah, I'm, I'm trying not to tip it up. Quite conscious that and then, I don't want to snort the balls. We've had this one before, this is not just Christmas. It's Well it is Christmas, it's a dupe of Lush a snow fairy which obviously comes out at Christmas but she sells this one all year round so you can get snow fairy all year round and it's called snow pixie on her website that always smells good oh and it's just the best like we bought this last time and it is it burns for hours and hours and hours and it just smells amazing so that's yeah. what Lauren got today I am very impressed with those I think snow pixie obviously and probably Christmas Spice are my favourites. Um, Toast to Toes is very surprising that it smells like the men's aftershave. And then the Christmas Eve one, I'm not a huge fan of, but we'll see what it smells like when I burn it. But also, all all, I am very impressed. Also, I've been waiting for a delivery too, and it's not come. <laughs> and that is not cool. To be fair though, I have been waiting a week for this. So, Royal Mail, sort yourself out because it had a 48 hour sticker on it, and I've been waiting an entire week. 
eBay said it would be a today, and it's not. They lied. Jerks. Lies. Massive jerks. <laughs> Lying jerks. Do you want to see what I've bought Lauren to eat tonight? I really wanted something and custard. <laughs> Shall I show you what I've got for Lauren to eat? Don't be... It's this. Yes. Raspberry and vanilla Swiss roll. Because she, she keeps saying I want something with custard. So this is what I've selected to go with custard. Although I don't really like that. So I've got... Uh, I've got chocolate. This one's mine. You've had some. Yeah, I've got, I got hungry. I'm not a big fan of chocolate sponge. I prefer vanilla sponge. So this is a big win for me. Dirty witch. <laughs> We watched the finale of Shane Dawson's series on Jake Paul last night. Yeah. It was an hour and 45 minutes of greatness. <laughs> yeah, we've been looking forward to it. Yeah, like I've just done a complete like 360 on my feelings on Jake Paul. Like by the end of it, I felt really sorry for him. Yeah. Um, Like it seemed genuine. Obviously you never know, but it seemed genuine. And like, I think a lot of things have sort of messed him up. His brother mainly. So, so he's just a messed up guy. If you've not sat down for the finale, get cosy, get a drink and watch it because it was amazing. <laughs> it's like really interesting even if you don't know who Jay Paul is. Like I yeah, don't particularly it, know. But it was a real good series, wasn't it? Yeah, so go watch it. Yeah. That's the review. And the batch is still flashing. <laughs> but tonight, tonight, Making a Murderer 2 got released on Netflix today. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yes. So, so, tonight we're going to be Netflixing and chilling. And Swiss rolling and custarding and eating pizza. <laughs> You're I'm not eating pizza. pizza because he doesn't like pizza. I'm eating pizza. I'm having chicken nuggets. Because <laughs> we are essentially five. Yeah. <laughs> and with that being said, we're going to get gone. So, I'll see you guys. Next time. Peace.